Hi, today I'm going to show you how to make a zebra bunt cake. I already preheated my oven to 350 degrees and I did not have to grease my bundt cake pan because it is a non-stick but if yours is not a non-stick pan you have to grease it with butter and dust it off with flour. Now I will tell you the ingredients. Two cups of all-purpose flour, one-fourth a cup of cocoa powder, eggs four, melted butter half a cup, powdered sugar one cup, baking powder one teaspoon, baking soda half a teaspoon, vanilla essence one teaspoon, and milk half a cup, and salt a pinch. Now let's start making it. First you need to seed the all-purpose flour, baking powder, baking soda, and salt. Now I'm done sieving, so let's keep it aside. Now we have to add the butter and the sugar and cream it well. Next you have to add the vanilla and the eggs. Now let's add the rest and make a smooth batter. Now the batter is ready so I'll divide it into two parts and add cocoa powder to one part. Now let's sieve the cocoa powder into one part. Now I'll show you how to mix the cocoa powder into the batter. Now I'll show you how to add the batter into the pan. First you take some of the white batter and put it inside. You don't have to spread it with the spoon because it will spread all by itself. Now my cake is ready to put in the oven. You have to wait for 30 to 35 minutes. It's been 35 minutes, so let's check if the cake has been baked. toothpick is clean so that means that it's ready. Now you have to let it cool for 15 minutes. Now it's time to taste it. It tastes good and I hope you try to make this cake and I hope you liked watching my video. Thank you!